Hey guys, this is Hafiz and today I'm going to show you guys how to change the airbag and if that uh, airbag pop on the road, how can you save the road service? As you can see, um, all other airbags are inflated except this one. Uh, I told the driver to bend uh, the airline that goes to the airbag and that's how you can stop the leak but uh, he cut the line so he did it wrong you can actually push it in and uh, you can easily pull out the airline airbags are pretty much same on every single truck and trailer except a couple of bowls and some sizes but uh, it's the same procedure so I'm going to show you how we can change it there's a uh, one bolt on the top um, and one at the bottom on this uh, uh, airbag which is a Freightliner truck and uh, it's so easy you can even use the, uh, the adjustable wrench or you can use uh, uh, the gun it's up to you um, but it's not that hard to change and it's gonna take only um, 15 to 20 minutes if you already know how to do it for the first time it might take half an hour but as you can see uh, there is a one bolt at the bottom and one on the top we already uh, took that off so we now remove this one and so the next step is just to push the airbag down and take it off so as you have noticed that uh, my airbags were up and uh, it's helping me actually uh, to pull out that uh, airbag because uh, the other bags are already inflated and uh, there is a room in between the, the frame and I can easily pull out the airbag. So the old airbag is removed and now we're going to add uh, a new airbag into the same uh, position as you can see one bolt at the bottom of this uh, airbag and then one is on the top and there's uh, another hole on top of the airbag which is for the air fittings which you don't get it uh, with the airbag so you have to remove it from the old airbag so you just align it and come inside the truck and lower the airbags so the airbags are sitting properly now we just need to make sure the air fitting is tight and put those bolts on Before you put the airline, make sure that uh, the air fitting is aligned and facing towards the airline and uh, make sure it's uh, open and all you have to do is just push it in and pull it back and it's locked. So the same way you can uh, remove this when uh, you have any kind of emergency and you can bend it with the zip tie. Now it's time to test it. You come inside the truck and inflate airbags and look for any air leak if there's any issues let the air build up all the way the airbags aftermarket may cost you $125 uh, approximately um, up to $200 and the road call or the repair for this might be $300 approximately so you might be looking at uh, $450, but if you do that by yourself, it costs you $125 only. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.